awful self-esteem 101 boop. <laughs> Hi guys, it's Adria, and for today's video, I... <laughs> okay, ignore my face, self-esteem 101, I don't care right now. <laughs> I'm gonna be starting a new series on my channel, and I hope that you guys are as psyched about this as I am. Adria, is this gonna be like every other series that you start on your channel and you're gonna do like five videos of it and then stop? I don't know, but I had a brilliant idea, and I don't know if this already exists. I don't wanna find out. I just ran my idea for this video by Brandon. He thinks it sounds like a good idea. Today's video, I am going to be applying my makeup using only a slice of bread. I don't know how well this is going to turn out. So, I have this bread here. It's gone slightly stale. I mean, not to the point where it's like a brick. If you want to see me apply my makeup using any other food besides bread, leave your ideas down in the comments below and I just might do it. Not baby carrots because I'm very much allergic to raw carrots. <laughs> you know what? Screw it. I might do that next. <laughs> Let's get started. Did I moisturize already? Honestly, don't remember. Oh well, too late. So uh, I'm gonna prime my face. So I'm gonna put this on like how I normally would and I'll blend it with the bread. So like I said, I don't know if this idea already exists. I didn't wanna find out. I wanted this to be like one of those things like, oh my gosh, I totally invented this even if I totally didn't. Oh. Oh, it smells good. Oh, girl. Anybody else love the bread aisle? Even if I don't need bread, I'm just like, let me just walk down here real quick. So, I wanted this to be like, I totally invented this. I mean, like, I thought of like cool creative inventions in my head, and then I find out they actually exist. And I'm just like, girl, I thought I invented that. You know what I mean? Yeah. Okay. So, uh, next, we're gonna take some of this green stuff. I never, well, do I? Yeah, I put this on with an applique. Okay, so I'm gonna put some of this on, like, I'll probably use the corner of the bread. I feel like that would. Definitely. Oh, yeah, like, see, I don't want to get breadcrumbs all in my makeup. That would not be good. Okay, so a little bit of that on the corner. Oh, it looks like mold. <clears throat> but yeah, I mean, like, one time I was writing a book. This book idea came to me in a dream. I thought I was a genius. I thought I was gonna be the next JK Rowling billionaire girl, like, come for me on Twitter, bitch. I thought I was a genius, and I described my idea to Brandon, and he's like, you mean the Matrix? What? I've never seen The Matrix before. I, like, girl, I don't, mm, girl. Is this actually working? Kind of. I think that the end of the bread will be good for like this kind of stuff. The actual bread itself might be good for like the foundation maybe. Almost like a sponge. I mean, this is working. So there was like that whole trend going around on YouTube, like, oh, putting makeup on with a condom. And I'm just like, girl, like, I'm just gonna use bread. <laughs> I don't know, I thought that whole condom trend was so stupid. I like the condom challenge better where you actually like stick it up your nose and pull it out your mouth. Putting your makeup on with it, I'm like, mm-mm, mm-mm. Now I look like I have a disease, more so than I usually do. Uh, that's pretty good. Actually, you know what? I feel like this actually went on better than it normally does. Since the bread is so like firm, it doesn't absorb into it, so it really like blends it out more. It's almost like a beauty blender. <gasps> This is like an at-home beauty blender. Maybe I could even roll it up like one. So now it is time for foundation. I'm running pretty low. As everybody knows, foundation is not cheap makeup, so I feel really, really weird about to spread it on some bread. Um, ooh. Is that, oh, it's working! Maybe I should put the foundation like on my face first. I don't really just want to scrape it into the bread. So uh, definitely let me know other kinds of foods you would want to see me try this with. What if I did it with like a Big Mac or something? But that, my face would look worse than it does. <laughs> Girl, I don't know if I need that in my life. It's getting crumbs everywhere. All right, I think I gotta go back to the butt. I think the butt might actually be a nice affordable dupe for a beauty blender. Mmm and you can eat while you go. I've always wanted a beauty blender, but I'm like, girl, I don't know how I feel about spending like five bucks on a little sponge. I mean, like, look at that. I'm actually getting progress. Looks like you got some moldy bread. Just don't put it back in your cabinet and make your mom think, uh, girl, I just bought this bread. What the heck is going on? Publix, I'm gonna sue you. But no, like, have you ever come up with an idea and you think that you're the one to come up with it and then you realize it already exists and you just feel so sad? I don't know, sometimes, especially with like YouTube, I'll think of something, I'll be like, oh my gosh, I'm so creative, nobody got shit on me! And it's just like, girl, that's been in existence, and I'm just like, oh. I will say though, this is taking a lot longer than usual. Ooh. And there's crumbs everywhere. It looks a lot better on camera than it does, like, IRL. Ooh, you know what, I could use this little piece for like, eyeshadow. I'm really kind of bummed that I'm doing this today because we're going to the movies later tonight. Why did I pick to do this today? 
hate when I don't put enough foundation on and you can see the green makeup and I just look like the Hulk or like I had a one night stand with the Hulk. Was this the dumbest video idea of my life? I could do the baby carrots though to see if I have like the worst allergic reaction of my life. Does anybody even eat this piece? I mean, I do. I sacrifice myself for Brandon so that he doesn't have to eat it. I'll be the hero. I mean, I see all these like makeup trends and beauty trends. I'm like, man, I wanna think of one. I wanna come up with something that I see Jeffree Star doing. I can't really see Jeffree Star doing something like this though, girl. But uh, I mean, like I wanna come up with a makeup trend. Why not? It didn't exactly give me the best coverage. I look like I still don't have makeup on. So, I mean, if you want a makeup look that's like, I'm not wearing any makeup. There you go. Let's do some eyeshadow. So I'm gonna use this little piece of bread. I don't even know, is this crust? Like where did this even come from? Let's dip into the Beauty Killer palette with bread. I feel like this is such a bad idea. I mean, it's definitely good for a natural look, girl. I mean, cause like, what if you're in a pinch and you don't have any makeup brushes and all you had is some stuff to make some sandwiches? I mean, it's like, girl, you got this, you can do it. Why wouldn't you wanna try this? <laughs> Honestly, I feel really gross right now. It kind of feels like I've worn my makeup all day and I should be taking it off right now. Oh, I wonder if I could put lipstick on with this. Let's try. Do you think I can do it, guys? <gasps> I mean, like, hi. It tastes like I'm eating a sandwich while I'm doing my makeup, which, I mean, I've done before. Did I have an eye booger this entire time? No, you know what I look like right now? I look like that little monster from Monsters, Inc. when he gets his mouth stuck in that thing, and then they pull his mouth out, and he's like, <gasps> that's what I look like. <laughs> Can you even see how awful this looks right now? Let's try some highlight. Oh, you know what? I'll use the crust. Because see, then what if I did this video with like, oh, putting my makeup on with a Big Mac? Then how would I do this? I'm, I'm not gonna... Girl. Ooh, feels like a sponge to do the dishes. Okay, that is not showing up at all. I look dead. Okay, so maybe this is good funeral makeup. Like, girl, I'm ready to go to that funeral because like, I look dead. I'm using the butt piece again. Some up here. I guess I could try my eyebrows. Try. I'm gonna have to come up with a better idea to get the makeup actually out of the thing so that I don't have to stick food directly in my makeup because that's just... Bitch. Tell me how that actually worked. <laughs> okay, oh, girl. I mean, like, hello. Let's try blush. Okay, Ugh. the ants are gonna love this. The ants right now are probably like, oh, good thing we chose this apartment where the girl that lives here puts makeup on using bread. <laughs> Can you put makeup on using only bread? I would definitely say yes. On a scale of one to 10, I would give this like a four. Maybe mascara will fix it. I, don't, I, look, I look really dead right now. And I don't know how I would put mascara on using bread. So before anybody's like, Adria, you're not using the bread. Girl, how am I supposed to get? You know what, let's try it real quick. Uh, I'm gonna get bread in my eye. <laughs> not bad. I'm gonna go make a sandwich out of my face. I think definitely overall the butt piece was the most useful of the breads. The actual bread itself really just got crumbs all over everything. I don't know why I didn't really think of that. Perhaps maybe because it's a little bit stale. Yeah, using my scientific prediction, I think it would have come out a little better had I used some fresh bread. But anyway, so I was gonna maybe like later on, a few hours later, show how the makeup held up. I don't know why I thought I would be able to actually wear this makeup. I don't really think I wanna go to the movies looking like this. I, although, this is how my makeup looked in middle school, to be honest. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and definitely let me know down in the comments below if you think I should do more foods. If so, what food should I try to apply my makeup with next? I mean, and if you wanna give makeup with bread a shot on your channel and like link it to me on Twitter or something, girl, like definitely do that. I would love to see that. This is beautiful. <laughs> I will see you guys again real soon. Until then, panda hugs. I love you guys. What even is that? <laughs> like, I don't even know what that noise is. NASA, Rocky Launch.
You're cute.